This is the worst birthday of my life. Even my parents are busy at a town meeting. Oh, I guess everybody's got something better to do tonight. Now, what have we here? Hey, at least something's going right tonight. Now, what's this? A note? Good for one free soda on your birthday. Hmm. My luck is changing after all. I appreciate the soda, Mr. Lawson. At least I got one treat today. Well, I must say, you looked pretty birthday. Uh, thirsty. Oof! Why, uh, uh, hello there. The store's open late tonight. Yes. I just finished serving Gilbert here a soda. Did you know it's his birthday? You don't say. And how are you spending it, Gilbert? I guess I'll see if this old rope can lasso something. So long. Uh, 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 Gilbert, um, you know, I have um, uh, some new rope back at Green Gables. I could make you a proper lasso. You could? Now, why don't you just head on inside while I put the sorrel mare into the barn? Anne should be there. You know, we can have some hot cocoa. So this is what it's come to. Hot cocoa with Anne and Mr. Cuthbert. Why, Gilbert, what a surprise. Come in. Anne, you'll never guess who's here. Miss Cuthbert, uh, what's that on your head? What? Oh, oh, well, it's no, nothing. <laughs> oh, I, I just dropped by to... Surprise! Surprise! <gasps> Three cheers for Gilbert! Hip, hip! Hooray! Anne, how'd you know I'd show up? It's all thanks to Felix. I just put myself in your shoes and imagine what you'd do. Well, Felix, it was a great plan. This is the most wonderful birthday anybody could hope for. <laughs> Almost got it! <laughs> One more good hit, Gilbert! experience has transformed me forever. Have no fear. I won't put myself in your shoes the weeks before my birthday. I'd hate to deduce your plot should you decide to hold me a surprise party. <laughs> oh, Anne. We'll see, Anne. <laughs> well, shall we? Slight late start because of the broken wing, but here's the whole route. With stops in Tokyo and Paris to refuel. You're going to Paris? Yeah, wanna come? To the City of Love? That's what they call it. You're asking me to go to the City of Love with you. Yeah, it'll be fun. Now, let me see if I got this straight. Hey, Jitterbell, I'm going with you to make sure you don't cheat. Okay, so, Belgi, you wanna come too? Well, I get one carry on. All right, carry on then. Did you get that wing fixed yet? I guess so. We pretty much used up all the packing tape. Okay, the clock is ticking, everyone. Daddy, what is going on here? We're flying around the world to make the longest, funnest day of summer ever. Oh, no, no, no. Mom left me in charge, and I say you and your little friends are not going anywhere. Hey, Candace, check out this giant map. You're going to Paris? France? That's the plan. We'll have to stop and refuel. <laughs> Like I was saying, you and your little friends are not going anywhere without me. No, 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 Candace. This is a bad idea. About as bad as you've ever had in a long line of, and I love you when I say this, really, really bad ideas. Stacy, they're going to Paris, where Jeremy is. You promised your mom you'd keep your brothers out of trouble. What better way to look after them than by going along and keeping them out of trouble along the way? You realize that's a massive rationalization, don't you? Oh, yeah, totally. Well... Say hi to Jeremy for me. And hey, you should stop by and see my cousins in Tokyo. Oh, 
this can't be good. No! Vanessa! No! Oh, they caught her! They caught her! But Ferb? Vanessa? No matter where we go, Ferb knows everyone. Thanks, guys. It's a good thing we came along when we did. So where can we drop you? I don't know. Where are you guys going? Well, we're off to Paris to refuel and then back to Danville. Can I just come with you? Sure. Wait, wait, you saved her and now you're running off with her? Like, oh, I have very mixed feelings about you. So, how'd it go? into Paris. How is that good news? Huh? I thought you wanted to go to Paris. Oh, yeah, I did. <gasps> I'm feeling very conflicted about this. Okay, everybody, let's get going. Candace, you go see Jeremy. Way ahead of you. Now, Jean and Buford, you guys go scare up the fuel we need. You're still gonna lose, but I do like scaring things. Ferb, why don't you go to the Eiffel Tower and get a reading on the trade winds? Hop on. Vanessa, you rented a scooter. Uh, yeah. Rented. <laughs> I'm gonna go see if I can't find some parts. Isabella, you wanna come with me? Yes! I mean, I mean, yeah, sure, you know, whatever. It's all good, bro. Sophia! Where is this thing taking us? <laughs> well, it's definitely taking us somewhere. That's funny. We're landing. Why? The book said the Mystic Isles are up, not down. Enchanted elevator. There must be a way to get to the Mystic Isles from here. Let's hope so. There goes our ride. What are we even supposed to be looking for? I'm not sure. Maybe a flying coach, or a magical creature, or a girl. Oh, oh my! Oh, I do hope I didn't startle you. Oh, that crystal looks so familiar. It's magical, isn't it? Uh, yes. How did you know? Oh, I know an awful lot about magic crystals. You see, I'm a crystal master. At least, I was once. What do you mean, once? My terribly unkind sister, Azarine, took my crystal powers away. She turned my beautiful crystal self into the regular girl you see before you. I had to flee our home in the Mystic Isles, and now I'm trying to get back. Oh, we're headed to the Mystic Isles to stop a mean Crystal Master right now. That must be your sister. You think so? Oh, do let me come with you. Then if I get my powers back, I can help you stop Azarine. Well, we could always use another hand. Sure, we'll take you with us. Oh, thank you. Thank you ever so much. I'm Prisma, by the way. Princess Sophia. Princess Amber. Oh, this must be my lucky day. I've been wandering this field waiting and hoping for the unicorns. Unicorns? Yes, to come fly me back to the isles. But now your amulet can summon them. You simply must ask it. Really? It can summon unicorns? Oh, you see why I want an amulet? Okay, I'll try it. Um, please send some unicorns. <laughs> Who 
summons the unicorns of the Mystic Isles. Uh, hi! I'm Sophia of Enchantia, and this is my sister, Amber. Do you wish for passage to the Mystic Isles? Yes, please. Wait! Oh, I can understand. Unicorns? Oh, yes. Every creature from the Mystic Isles can magically talk to others. Quickly, girls, hop on! 